There is one Quinnipiac bobcat who worries quite a bit about tying up loose ends. So we wonder, what is it that brought Julie here all the way from Sierra Leone? DOA. The campus was a great looking campus. The students were really good. Uh, players were really good. Coaches were really good. And, you know, by the time I left here, I already knew I wanted to come to Quinnipiac. Coming from Sierra Leone at a young age, Dooley took refuge in basketball, trying to make it a high point in life. At a time when Dooley is taking great leaps in his life, he does struggle with being an international student. The hardest thing about being away from home, I'd have to say, is just the fact that I miss my family. You know, and it's like a 20 hour flight, and I just can't go home as often as I'd like to. I've learned over there, I brought over here as far as just being aware, being appreciative. I'd be, probably take these same skills back home to Sierra Leone, help us out, just to help living over there a little bit easier. And finding a groove to get into hasn't been entirely bad. Julie is always looking to the brighter side of things. But of all things, it's passing the ball to the next generation that he looks forward to. I want to work with kids. Uh, they're kids in, like that's been in my position, and I want to basically show them the help, the love, the support that I received growing up. And to get there, Dooley will ignore critics and stick to his very own philosophy. I'd say take it day by day. Uh, a lot of people ask me why do I walk so slow, and I always tell them the same thing. I always say life's moving too fast, so I'd rather just slow down and enjoy the view, enjoy every moment. And this is Shayla Cologne, Q30 News. I want to work with kids. Uh, they're kids in, like that's been in my position, and I want to basically show them the help, the love, the support that I received growing up.